Dr. Gardner, my patients frequently ask me, how can I keep my pancreas healthy? Any hints, any comments? That's a great question, Dr. Gilbert. So one of the major things that we encourage patients to do is to really try to follow a healthy diet. So that involves a well-balanced, nutritious diet, trying to limit the amount of fat uh, that patients eat because eating fat puts a lot of uh, stress on the pancreas when it's ill. So we really try to have patients follow a healthy diet. We also really encourage patients to avoid alcohol because alcohol call can have a very toxic effect on the pancreas and cause some major problems, as well as smoking. Uh, smoking, we know as well, can have a major effect on the pancreas. Uh, we also like patients to get plenty of exercise and really try to keep their uh, weight down and within a good range. Uh, so generally, healthy lifestyle habits that are good for your heart and good for your lungs, uh, those are also very good for your pancreas as well. Oh, I agree. We also tend to tell them, you know, that the pancreas, for some reason that we still don't know exactly why, it's an organ that likes to be surrounded by water. Mm -hmm. So we, tell to t we tend to tell the patients to stay well hydrated, mm -hmm. you know, all the time. Well, that's a very good point. I think when the pancreas gets sick, one of the major reasons why is because it doesn't have enough water and does get dehydrated.